Good day everyone, my name is Rinja Berger and I'm the Engagement Manager for the Financial Planning and Analysis Division at Decision Inc. And I'm David Kemper, the Regional Business Head of the Western Cape for Decision Inc. Decision Inc has been a long-standing partner of the Faschini Group, specifically in their financial planning analytics space. In 2020, we partnered with Faschini on an entirely new planning journey, one that focused on top-down driver-based planning, as opposed to the traditional bottom-up planning. TFG is a large retail group operating across Africa, the United Kingdom and Australia with more than 18 brands and 2,000 stores. The Faschini Group needs to keep their finger on the pulse with respect to the market and environment they operate in. One of the critical parts of this is making sure that their digital strategy, including that of their FP&A division, backs up their business strategy and go-to-market. Budget and forecast are detailed plans at a tactical level. If a forecast goes off plan, a scenario model will enable a business to determine the corrective actions they need to take to keep back on track that is in line with their strategy. With all the technologies that exist at TFG, a couple of challenges arises. For example, outdated forecast methods by using offline Excel, merging non-SAP source data manually to combine master and transactional data, as well as historical data that is not available on demand for version planning. TFG's focus is to obtain a centralized planning solution that will combine their merchandise and financial planning as well as improve each perspective planning cycle. With all the planning and reporting requirements coming out of Fashini, as well as their new approach to planning, the preferred technology of choice was SAP Analytics Cloud. SAC is one of the top cloud planning platforms that has the power to integrate process and analyze real-time information to provide valuable insights. By using SAC, Decision Inc. were able to provide TFG with a platform where they can identify their key drivers to generate and predict potential outcomes that is in line with each of their strategies. SAC also offers interactive visualizations and dashboards to provide valuable outputs, enabling a non-technical user group with machine-generated analytics and insights without learning complicated script languages. Let's take a look at the demonstration. The first step is for each merchandise planner to capture the applicable brand's units into the merchandise model. These units are then copied across to the logistics model. High level adjustments to the units for each respective month can be done if needed. Any additional monetary adjustments are also provided for. The second step requires an input to allocate a percentage of the total or adjusted units to be shipped and an input to split the units into a percentage allocation from where it will be dispatched and in addition where to dispatch the units to merchandise categories. These include clothing, footwear, and jewelry, to name a few. Once all the DC planning is completed, the user will move on to transport planning. SAC automatically pulls through the units to be shipped as calculated during DC planning. Once all data capturing is completed and all adjustments have been made, units will be allocated per shipment type and multiplied by sizing rates and location to calculate your total shipment type per location. Now that all the calculations have been made, the user can move on to their reporting. SAC offers various filtering options to allow the user to select periods, cost centers, or even comparative versions. The ability to drill down into the cost into as much detail as they deem necessary is enabled by making use of hierarchies. In summary, the world we live and operate in is changing every day. What we did in the past is no longer relevant to what we need to do in the future, and the office of the CFO is no different. For more information and to be able to contact us, feel free to visit our website at decisioninc.com.